Okay, Don. Yeah, about the bucket. An ordinary bucket, they pick them up. Five uh, gallons. Restaurants or any place. Drill they the usually throw those things away, don't they? Or recycle them. Yeah, yeah, the idea is to keep your shrimp alive. And if you got a good fresh shrimp, when you take the head off, it'll devan at the same time. So you want to okay. keep them alive. So to do that, we have this stick in here, and as you catch shrimp, you lower the bucket into the water to keep them alive. Okay, so you got a set of holes on opposite sides? This sits on a float. We'll give you an example of a float we're using here. It's basically a styrofoam ring. Place the bucket in the styrofoam ring and it keeps it out of the water, but provides access a little bit so that the shrimp can swim. And as you go through deeper or shallower water, you may need to adjust the level of the bucket so that you can accommodate the grass. But you may uh, also just catch so many shrimp that you can no longer fit them all in the bucket without killing them unless you give them more water. So, the stick was born. Simple, yeah. simple raft with a stick. Whoops. Yeah. Go. Well, that's all right. Simple raft with a stick coming through it to give it some balance. Floats behind you. While you're on the water, you just so as your bucket now, as your bucket gets now, full of shrimp, you can lower yeah, it down and deeper. What we did now, a shrimp will jump out of that, so you got to put the lid on. And we, what cut. we do is we cut this in pie shapes, press cool. it down over like a coffee can, cool. and put a heat on it, and then it'll stay that form. So you got a cornucopia, and the shrimp can't in, jump back and out. It's very hard for a shrimp to jump out of that. Good deal. Yeah. Oh, and another thing is, cut all these edges. These buckets lids yeah. are very hard to get off when those uh, sure. all those edges are on. So we leave one on one side, one on the other, 